Exactly. It's every day. This happened like two and a half years ago. Um, but I was this baker in uh, Ithaca, New York, and uh, it was actually my second day on the job, and people were always like, don't get your hand stuck in this machine, because like it was this big conveyor belt with like rollers and everything. What happened was, what the conveyor belt? So, the conveyor it was two different machines, <laughs> like one of them, like you put the dough two, on the top, two, and it cut it out together, to big a one. big specific weight, and then it kind of like shoved it out onto this other conveyor belt. And then it went through a roller that which rolled it out to the length, and then it went no. through this uh, thing that formed it into a bagel. <laughs> no, I'm trying to okay. explain this machine. <laughs> it is pretty <laughs> much a goddamn conveyor belt. Who are trying to visualize? You, you, you had like eight I can, I, I, can, I can draw a diagram if you wish. Yes. <laughs> Sounds like the most amazing machine. But anyway, it's, it's actually a really... <laughs> It's actually it was like mouse pretty track. cool. I mean, it's a cool machine I mean, for what it does. Only it makes bangles. But anyway, um, <laughs> what happened was a big blob of dough fell Show on the bottom track. thing and it got stuck in one of the rollers. And um, I had to scrape it off. And nobody told me how to hold the scraper. So, of course, like a dumbass, I was scraping it off like this. You're supposed to hold it like this. But I was holding it like this. Hand in the machine. And, um... <laughs> It, it, it hit a piece of dried <laughs> dough on the belt, stuck my hand down, and then it just scooped up around the roller. Ooh. And pretty much my hand yeah. just got sandblasted. And I was looking around, nobody was standing around me. I'm like, help, <laughs> help. <laughs> and then I looked like, around, and I'm like, oi! <laughs> and then people came running. <laughs> <laughs> Was what is that? And then two days later, I'm like I'm like, oh no, <laughs> I've had worse because I used to bike message in DC. Got hit by cars from sliding like 30 feet on the concrete. Had horrible like road burn. And I'm like, oh, it'll be fine. And it was like from here to here. And I'm just like, yeah, it'll be fine. Like it's just a bad road rash. Skin graft. Two days later, I go to the hospital. I'm like, oh, you need a skin graft. Up your ass. ass. Uh, yeah, that skin graft that came off my leg. Dude, if I had ass skin on my head, you realize how hairy that would be? Yeah. What does that have to do with a Nazi kicking his head out? <laughs> Absolutely not. That's a completely different story. He just wanted to tell us about the hair, though. <laughs> I thought you were building up to a story about a Nazi kicking oh, your teeth no, off. Yeah. Okay, so out of nowhere, the Nazi walks to the bakery and like, hey, nice hand, you kicks in the shop. That's what you get from losing your hand. So, okay, Nazi kicking my teeth story. So, um, I hear the UK subs and Hep C are playing up at the pound in San Francisco. So, we go up there, <coughs> me, me and my friend Russell, Russell's driving his mom's van up there, and I'm squatting in Santa Cruz, so I hop in the van, I'm like, how am I getting in? They're like, I don't know, we'll figure it out. So I end up getting in on the guest list, and uh, I, don't, I don't even know how, but we met these two chicks, Tiffany and... Um, I can't remember the bitch I fuck's name. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I really can't. I mean, you, That's you, you, bad because I remember but the it's other one. Right. I remember <laughs> the one I fucked. What's the point is you got your dick on. <laughs> Dude, she was an ogre. <laughs> but I was drunk, so it's okay. So anyway, I go in. <laughs> and then, so like, I go home and I'm living like, not in Santa Cruz, I'm living in uh, this... Other, it's uh, in between San Jose and San Francisco. I can't remember the name of the town. It's, oh, yeah, it's a fucking under the shithole. bridge and a band down by the bridge. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, so like, and then uh, so her mom finds out I'm living in a garage, so she kicks us both out. So and then we, so uh, we're we're kind of like not really freaking out, just kind of getting drunk. And then we find out, uh, we, we call up a friend, and he's like, oh, fuck this, it's my birthday today. I'm like, well, I don't know this right, where's the Nazi? <laughs> I, 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 it, it'll get there, it'll get there. So, it's my birthday. It is like coincidence with how, well, not really. I'm sorry, well, I guess that's why it's from out. But anyway, so, we had this hotel party, and... 
<laughs> we get trash as fuck, face bags galore, fucking liquor everywhere. And um, I wake up, and all there, yeah. Box of <laughs> back sentence. <laughs> anyway, so I wake up in the morning. I was ch- literally too drunk to fuck that night. I tried, but it just didn't happen. Jilly Biafra would have been proud. <laughs> yeah, he probably would have been, except that guy's a fucking asshole. But anyway, so I wake up the next morning and it's still a 12 pack of Miller High Life. <coughs> So I wake up, and I look at the refrigerator to see what's left, and there's a 12-pack. So I drink, pull that out, and I'm on my fourth beer when everybody else wakes up. And then, and then my girlfriend thinks, so my girlfriend at the time, the one I can't remember the name, she thinks to reach underneath the bed, and there's a false face bag that I had hid under there, because I was worried about all the beer running out. <laughs> so we have that. And then we, and then we go up to fucking uh, San Francisco, and they sell liquor in grocery stores. So I still two fifths of Jaeger from this Trader Joe's. So I have two fifths of Jaeger in my pocket, and I'm fucking chugging those, like offering it to random people on the street. I offered a fifth of Jaeger to a cop, and the cop just looked at me and was like, "Get the fuck out of here!" And I'm like. See you later, pig. And then I just kept walking. <laughs> <laughs>